I think experiential learning at BG is an incredibly important component of the BG experience, and the Center for Undergraduate Research and Scholarship does a great job in providing funding for students, especially through small grants and fellowships. KERS offers research and travel grants to do research with faculty on campus. You're able to put together a proposal, a budget for what you need for your research, supplies that you may need, travel expenses. Dr. Morrow is going to probably find a way to help you get that funding so that you can do your research to the best of your ability. You know, being a part of CURS and having that funding has really given me the opportunity to spend a lot of time understanding the process of science and giving me the knowledge that it's something I want to dedicate the rest of my career to, to, um, to being a scientific researcher with the hopes to improve society. To do research in biology, to do particular public policy projects out in the community or sociological field research and things, and actually begin to get experience and dabble in the academic field that they're trying to make part of their career. I think one of the things I'm most impressed with when I talk to students today is that they are doing real work. Many of these students are going to publish, they're going to participate in regional and national and international conferences. They're going to have created new knowledge that's going to actually move the field that they're studying in. They're not waiting until they're in graduate school or until they're out in the workforce to actually do something that will be impactful on the field that they're interested in and that's an amazing opportunity for them. I really wanted to combine art and biology in my project because I'm really passionate about promoting interaction between artists and scientists. So I worked with Dr. Underwood from the BGSU Herpetarium. This is an awesome like experiential learning program for me and it will definitely help me in my future because I'm aspiring to be a naturalist and artist at the same time. History is one of my greatest passions and to learn more about things that I'm interested in and to discover things about the past that I had no idea or didn't know about and to refine my skills with the help of some of my professors. That's been a great pleasure. So as a BGSU student, it's really important that we are educated about diversity. And I think for our project in particular, we are looking at collaboration with as many different fields as we could. So we are working with the biology department, with the agriculture students, with architecture students, that type of thing, to see if we could draw in as many different people and hear ideas from many different people as well. There's a lot of different kinds of humanity and to raise the awareness among the student body of all the different ways that people can be different, I think it enhances our community and enhances our educational mission here to help people understand one another. I developed the skills of trying to be more independent and trying to conduct research without maybe a mentor or fellow students there. So I think it's important for students to try new things, develop new skills, and this program is definitely great at doing that. The whole notion that they've done a project with a faculty mentor and that faculty mentor has invited them into the research world and has then worked with the student to analyze the data and begin to think about how they're going to share it with an outside audience is an incredibly critical part of the learning experience for students. As I walk around the halls today, what I keep seeing is students having to talk about their ideas, defend their assumptions, and defend the, the conclusions they've come to, and that's going to make them a better researcher, a better graduate student, a better professional when they leave us. This is a great opportunity, and I always tell students this is low pressure. Yeah, we're getting judged, but this is a chance to get your feet wet. This is a chance to, to get some experience uh, not only putting together a research poster and so saying, here's my research, but I got to put it together in an understandable form and then actually present on it. And so this is absolutely wonderful experience for students uh, across the board. And then specifically for this one, it's a, it's a chance to do so in a way that, that takes into account the themes of diversity, inclusion. KERS has been a very important part of my career path so far. It has already networked me with multiple people. It has opened my eyes to research and how it's completed, how it can be better. I think that the undergraduate research program is beneficial for students to be in because it allows them to connect with people who are doing research that they're interested in and similar to their interests. I've done a lot of networking ever since I've been involved in the CURSE program. I've met a lot of people who were interested in my research and wanted to learn more or had advice or different learning experiences that they were able to give to me. Being part of KERS has transformed me in my regular life by making me more outgoing and talking with other professors. So it kind of showed me how to like interact with my own faculty mentor and also made me feel more inquisitive by like knowing which questions to ask. When you have a mentor, you have access to their population and their resources and their network of people. So it builds you on a larger scale. You know, like what I do, I said a sociological. So my advisors in the Department of Sociology, if I ever decide I don't want to go into the field that I'm going into now, like medicine and medical stuff, I can go ahead and say, hey, you know, I want to go ahead and do sociology. And I've already got the backing. 
And that's the really cool thing about it is that I already have the safety net. And that's what Curse is, is it's a safety net. This is a lot of fun for me, it's not really work, but it could turn into work and I could do something more with it. That's a really kind of low key opportunity that not a lot of students know about, but definitely more students should take advantage.